Hello, this is Tino, CEO here at Sots. This is young Mike here. Picking up the special custom made piece. Yes, sir. It's on that VVS. Oh, living the life. That's your mom. Well, let me look at the mom first. Then. But actually, they look like two girls. Damn, they look like an old lady. So anyway, y'all, I'm about to get my chain now, man. It's been a minute, and let me tell you why it's been a minute. Basically, I was taking a bunch of L's, you know what I'm saying? Back-to-back -back L's. I'm talking about police took six grand, you know. Police took another this, another that, whatever, you know. Even losing money, you know, on my own behalf. And, you know, things pop up. Expenses, and I was buying a lot of designer at one point, and... All that stuff is really, you learn from your mistakes, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm here today with a bunch of knowledge now, you know what I'm saying? A bunch of learned mistakes, and I grinded so hard, bro. Like, I was just thinking last night, like, wow, I've been grinding so hard, and I just leave that chain in there because I always take my money, I always invest it in making more money or something like that, you know? I'm always smart with my stuff. You don't want to spend all your money you got. So, um, basically, I actually spent all my money I had one time in this mall before. And I'm talking about this is when I was really, really broke. I didn't have a car. I actually took the bus to the this mall, this exact mall. And I lost my bus ticket, so I had no money left. I had a bag full of fucking fake jewelry and no bus ticket. I walked my happy ass home and I learned my lesson on not to spend all your money. You know what I'm saying? So, basically... I saved up, I saved up, and finally, I'm here with the other half of the money for my chain, man. This chain, man, is equivalent to, each letter was twenty five to $2,600, okay? I have about nine letters. So you do the math, man. This is a $20,000 chain, and I'm about to get that shit out today, man. I fucking can't wait. We're finally here. I don't want to hear no bullshit, man. I want to get my chain now, and that's it. You feel what I'm saying, guys? So, let's go see what's up. Call me the fastest. That's big, guys. Yeah. <laughs> I love that because see, 
Everybody has the rope chain, bro. Hold on, man. Let me make sure I got no boogies in my nose. Hold on, man. Hold on, hold on. Big point is in my ears, in my chain. I just spent 3000 on a fucking chain, stupid shit. That's not even including the pendant. 3K on the chain, 20000 on the pendant, nigga. That's 23000 Add up the math, it's 25 grand, bitch. Hey, damn, son. Yeah. You do it. You got it. Hey, chill. <clears throat> oh, hey there, man. I ain't see y'all. It's the next day, man. As y'all can see, I had caught a new chain. So, like, you know, the chain itself. My other one cost three thousand. So this one cost about two grand. The chain, and this is a. Uh, Cholo chain? What do they call it? Chino chain, my bad. It's a Chino chain. And he also gave me compensation with that on this thousand dollar ring right here. You know, we got the VVS uh, ones right there. And then it matches my Jesus piece ring right here. You know, we got the Virgin Mary, the Jesus piece, you know what I'm saying? And we got the young Mike piece, baby. If y'all looking in the market to buy a chain and y'all interested in buying yourself a chain, I'm gonna give y'all some advice, you know, before y'all buy that chain. So, first off, a lot of people fake it till they make it, and there's nothing wrong with that. Trust me. Um, especially if you're buying SI diamonds or even little glass diamonds, you know, that are really not worth nothing. You might as well go buy fake shit because they're both worthless. You feel what I'm saying? So that's the thing. Like these diamonds right here are called pointers, and Basically, they're worth money. The diamonds that have pointers are worth money. Then I got gold, you know? A lot of gold right now is going up because um, money is, is deflating. So basically, the things that will never deflate is gold, um, online currency, like crypto. And that's why crypto is going up as well right now. Like, as the money deflates, as people more and more start use credit cards, etc., Stuff like gold and diamonds, even diamonds are gonna go up as well. But um, gold is definitely gonna stay at its value for a minute. So shout outs to the gold. Make sure y'all get gold if when y'all can. Like, oh, no. fuck is that? Who put out like the Fed and shit? Who the fuck is that? Mm -hmm. We could get. Marty up. What the? You have to make sure your stuff is worth money. Get the pointers. Get the big diamonds if you're gonna get diamonds, and get them for a good deal, man. You know. Uh, another thing is, if you're not ready to get a big boy chain, don't do it, man. I remember it was 2017. I got my first real chain. It was a big uh, rope chain with a Jesus piece. It was my first ever chain. I bought it for 880 bucks at a pawn shop, though. So if you would have, if I would have got that at a jeweler, it would have been at least an easy $2,500. But I went to a pawn shop and I just paid for basically the gold itself. So if you want gold, go to a pawn shop. Don't get ripped off from these um, jewelers because jewelers you pay for manufacturing and custom pieces. You know, you pay for hours and shit like that instead of just paying for the gold itself. And basically a lot of pawn shops will throw a hella deal, you know? Another thing is, if you, like I said, if you're not ready to buy your chain, 
don't buy your chain you know what i'm saying stack up invest and then when you have you know this amount for your chain times 10 go and buy your chain you know treat yourself don't fucking do that if you don't have the steady amounts to get that money like it's nothing back you know what i'm saying or something like that just make sure you have good investments and you're not investing like this this is not an investment this is a a reward you know it's not an investment this is not going to become more valuable in the future it could possibly deflate as soon as i walk out the jeweler but what i'm trying to tell y'all is make sure you have investments before you think that this is an investment or don't even i don't even know stack your bread you know what i'm saying if y'all like this video and y'all want to see more jewelry videos make sure y'all smack that thumbs up i have another piece coming I will do a video on it if y'all want to see that. So make sure y'all smack that thumbs up. And I'll be back at it with some more five videos. Oh, yeah.